No! That is the sound of the WWE Universe when Kurt Angle announced he's gonna fight Baron Corbin at WrestleMania. Mm -mm -mm. Nobody wants that. Nobody wants to see that. So, these are my top five, my fast five better WrestleMania opponents for Kurt Angle. At number five, Jeff Jarrett. Jeff Jarrett, Kurt Angle, both of them Hall of Famers, both of them at the end of their career, and both of them have a lot of history from TNA, Impact Wrestling. These two could both have their retirement match at WrestleMania. It could be a double retirement match. And as we saw, Jeff Jarrett can still go. So Angle versus Jarrett one last time. I'd be okay with that. At number four, the lunatic fringe, Dean Ambrose. As we all know, Dean Ambrose is leaving WWE in April. WrestleMania is in April. So why don't you use Dean Ambrose as a way for Kurt Angle to have a big match, a big opponent, a big name opponent, and Dean Ambrose can lose to Kurt Angle, and Kurt Angle can go out on a high note, beating a top star in his last ever match. Number three. These two have already had a WrestleMania match. WrestleMania 21. Kurt Angle against Shawn Michaels, Mr. WrestleMania. Now, I know Shawn Michaels is supposed to be retired, but he did come back for last year's Crown Jewel show in Saudi Arabia. And that match, that match was a stinker. Let's be honest, let's be fair. It was a bad match and does one of the greatest of all time, Shawn Michaels, want to end his career with that match? Does that match want to be the last line in his story? I don't think so. What would be a good story is Shawn Michaels coming out of retirement, rematch from WrestleMania 21. Kurt Angle won that time. This time, Shawn Michaels can win. And it's, it, it would be a pretty awesome match, I think. At number two, Kurt Angle. Olympic hero, American hero. Why not have Kurt Angle win a championship in his last ever match? How about Kurt Angle versus Samoa Joe for the US title? Mr. America, Mr. Olympic gold medalist, Kurt Angle. He wears a singlet with the American flag on it. So what better way to finish his career than by winning the United States title? And I know it would make Joe look bad, but that they've made Joe look bad ever since he came to WWE. So what's new? And it would be a good match. These two, same as Jeff Jarrett, these two, Angle and Joe, have a lot of history from TNA Impact Wrestling, but none in WWE. So one last time, one last chapter in the book, Joe, Angle, WrestleMania, US title on the line. And at number one, we want Cena, we want Cena, John Cena. This makes a lot of sense. In John Cena's first ever match on the WWE main roster, it was against Kurt Angle. So it makes sense. The beginning and the end, it, it all, it's all nicely tied together. Kurt Angle, John Cena, WrestleMania, yeah. So guys and girls, those are my top five, my fast five picks on who I think would be a much better opponent for Kurt Angle at WrestleMania. Baron Corbin, just, just put him in the battle royal. Please, please. But guys, let me know your thoughts. Who do you want to see go against Kurt Angle at WrestleMania? Maybe Undertaker, maybe Goldberg, Maybe Jason Jordan. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Make sure you like this video and subscribe. And hopefully, catch you next time. Stay too so sweet. Except for you, Baron Corbin. You're not getting a too sweet from me.
No, sorry. But everybody else, too sweet.